Okay, this video is for those who are in network marketing, direct sales, maybe you are in affiliate marketing, or maybe you are in real estate, or maybe insurance. So I'm going to share with you, right, how I use TikTok to find clients. So I've been using TikTok for three years to find clients and to sell my products. Um, years, years ago, during the pandemic, right, all my classes were cancelled, okay, because my, I was hired by UOB, DBS, CPF, uh, to teach their staff right on how to do grooming so it was really devastated for me back then when all my classes were cancelled but you know what business is business and we have to change our strategy almost every three years as I spoke to just now a um, business consultant right she is also telling me that every three years we need to evolve okay so I am looking at uh, Russell Brunson's book right now because I use Russell Brunson's book right to master the art of storytelling Okay, so um, people do not buy things based on logic, they buy based on emotion. So if you look at my videos, right, it's all based on emotion. Because back then for me, right, big paws, I have big, big paws. Okay? And I find that whatever makeup I use, right, I cannot conceal, I cannot, you know, reduce the appearance of the paws. Okay, but after I use my retinol for three years, guys, three years, and that's why I achieved this kind of skin. Okay, I never have good skin, guys, to be frank. I never have good skin. I have a lot of big paws and I have chicken pox scar, you know what I mean? So I was very, very insecure. And, you know, and if you're selling skincare, right, you need to walk the talk. And if you're doing image styling workshop, right, you need to walk the talk, you know what I mean? So that's why I find that um, when I use my story to tell, okay, to connect with the audience on TikTok. So a lot of audience on TikTok, right, they resonate with me and that's why they, uh, they trust me and they buy from me. So you need to share your story on how you fell in love with your products or why do you choose to be a real estate agent or insurance agent. And I just want to tell you one more thing is I never mention brands on TikTok. But why people choose to buy from you? Because they trust you and they love you. This is the type of um, parasocial relationship that you can build with your audience. Your recruiter or your company may tell you to always use their brand to promote. No, it doesn't work this way. Because if clients know this brand, they can go and buy on the internet, isn't it? Right? So, but you want them to buy from you. Okay? So that's why you must never, never indicate brands. Alright? I may go against your recruiter uh, way of marketing. Right? I've done this over 12 years and let me tell you, I'm always right. Okay? So, <laughs> alright? So this is what I learned um, when I do network marketing in the past. I never, never mention my brands, right? I want people to connect with me and I want to know their stories as well. So always when you connect with people, even when you are connecting with audience right online, right? I make sure that I hear them. When you learn to listen, you make a very good salesperson, right? Even if you want to recruit them later as part business partner, right? It'll be easier later because you already create that relationship. Follow me for more business tips. See you soon in my next video. Bye!